kupu aku i don't know kupu kapu <laughs> what am i trying to say you guys Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is one I've been trying to film literally since May. I've had a lot of these things since May, but luckily they are all still available on the website. So yeah, I figured it's not too late to do a Lush haul. I meant to do this back in May, but you guys, I just quarantine had taken over and your girl was not in any mood to be on camera doing anything. So now that we're in a good space, we feel good mentally. Now it's time I share my Lush favorites and a mini Lush haul with you guys. Um, if you guys do not know what Lush is, it's pretty much a store where you can either go in or shop online and it has they have everything like every skincare thing that you could think of they have all of it is handmade it's all natural you know ethically sourced it's just an amazing store like you can find stuff for your hair your teeth your feet your body shower bath they have everything and it's really well priced to me lush is kind of like a guilty pleasure it's definitely one thing that i splurge on when it's like my birthday or if it's for like a holiday i always tell someone to either get me nothing or get me something from lush so yeah it's become definitely my probably favorite store to be honest with you i love it so much and this video is not sponsored whatsoever every lush product that i own i have bought with my own coin okay <laughs> so yeah you guys i have a lot of favorites and i also have a small haul to show you guys the things that i've gotten that i haven't used yet but yeah if you guys are interested in seeing everything that i love thank you for watching also while you guys are here you may as well subscribe because it's just really nice it's a nice thing to do you know do something nice for the day so yeah if you guys are interested let's go ahead and get right into the video okay guys so first things first this video is in no order whatsoever i'm gonna probably just try to keep it kind of organized but we'll see what happens but yeah let's just go ahead and get straight into my favorite things that i've been loving recently and then we'll get into the haul when we get there so first things first we are going to be talking about dream cream now this is a body lotion and this bad boy has been my favorite i'll probably have to insert in like little clips but this is literally almost done i have been using this on my hands like every day during quarantine i don't know if you guys are like me but i have been doing so much cooking and cleaning and just everything and my hands have gotten so dry that literally I keep this in my kitchen so as soon as I finish washing dishes I can just slather some on it's so nice it's such a beautiful calming lather <laughs> lavender fragrance it smells so good and I love the way it feels on my skin it just makes me feel so like moisturized um the next thing that I have is We'll do another body lotion. I also love the Charity Pot body lotion. That one looks just like this one. I use this one on my hands a lot, especially when I do my nails. This one is also the same kind of rich emollient cream. It smells really good. And each time that you guys purchase one of these Charity Pots in store, it, they donate some of the proceeds or all the proceeds, I think, to the organization on the package they show you a lot of organizations and you can choose which one you want and yeah it's just a really cool thing uh let's see what else do we have let's go into i have one more lotion i want to show you guys and that is sleepy body lotion you guys i have so many of these i have one literally right there <laughs> next to my bed but this one is amazing look at that color it's like a very soft you can't see it i'll insert videos it's a very soft lavender scented lotion it's lavender and tonka bean it literally smells so good this is probably hands down my favorite fragrance from lush like of all time it's the most amazing amazing scented lotion it puts me like literally at ease it makes me so relaxed i sleepy is like my favorite it's probably my favorite one from lush hands down period 
but yeah so right now we're gonna go ahead and get into the shower gels because I do have a lot of shower gels that I love from Lush the first one we're gonna talk about is one that's new to me I actually got this back in May and we are currently <laughs> almost done with this bottle so this is a Nana and this says it is I'm not gonna read you guys all the descriptions just first and foremost but this says it's a get soft soothed and smooth this nourishing banana oat sensor now you guys this Nana smells so good now on the website they do give you descriptions of what each one smells like also in the bottle as well so when I read the description for this on the website it said that it smelled like banana bread so when I got it I was expecting to smell like banana bread like cinnamon and nutmeg and all that but to me this literally smells like a true like vanilla cake like this smells like a bakery it smells so good like literally the thing i love about lush shower gels is that when you wash with them they literally stay on your skin now for me i'm a body wash connoisseur i literally can never use the same body wash like i'm uh, maybe i'm bougie but i like to smell different every night depending on how my mood is and this one i use this for like a week straight it smells so good it's such a sensual like delicious smell like if you're about to hang out with your man or woman or whoever this one smells so good you literally smell like a snack the next one is something that was completely different for me and i bought this solely based on the reviews like i have this problem to where i buy something and i get so excited for it to come in the mail that i will just go on the website and stalk and see what like when it comes to lush i will stalk the website and see what products i don't have and read the reviews and see what other people say so this one is called lord of misrule and I bought it not just for the beautiful green color that it is because it literally is gorgeous I bought this because the reviews on the website were like amazing everybody on the website said that this is their holy grail body wash scent that I think it used to be limited edition and people would buy the huge $55 bottle of body wash because it smelled so good and reading the reviews I was like y'all are whatever y'all are pressed it's not it's probably not that deep probably not that serious didn't stop me from adding it to my cart though so once I got this you guys I literally I need to smell it this does not smell like a body wash this smells like a straight up high-end perfume it's got such a it's got such an amazing smell like it literally says get down and earthy with this herbal blend of spicy black pepper and patchouli oils that's exactly what it smells like like i'm not a huge patchouli person but the mix with black pepper it literally is like the sexiest like the sexiest sultriest scent i could smell i could imagine a man wearing this too it smells so good like literally it smells so good and you guys the reason why i buy the small bottles are because these are 10.95 usually and i think the next up price is like 24 dollars. so for me i like to kind of buy the smaller ones to test them out and they do tend to last me a very long time so because i don't like glob on a huge amount of body wash so i would say if you are interested these are really affordable when you think about the quality and the effort that's being put into it and also the fact that they stay onto your skin like this one i will wash my body with this at night and the next day i still smell like this like i don't have to put on a perfume any fancy scented lotions like this will have you smelling good like really good like oof, i love this one and then when this one runs out i think i might have to splurge on the big bottle but i don't know it just smells so good and i can see why it's a cult fave and why everyone loves it all right <laughs> next the next shower jelly i have is one that i use all the time i think this is my third bottle and this is american cream now originally i got this 
I ordered this bottle this time but I first tried it out when I was on vacation when I went to Florida and I remember Jackie Ina having a video and saying that like either it was in her video or it was on her insta stories and she was like this smells so good like this is such an amazing scent it's so girly and literally you guys when you smell it it is it smells so good it's it says it has strawberry and orange in it but to me it kind of smells like strawberry and powder like it has such a powdery fresh fragrance to it this one also oh excuse me this one also lasts really long on your skin this one smells so soft so girly this is definitely the kind of fragrance you'd wear if you were going on like a first date or just going out with your boyfriend or you know getting really girly and glam this one just smells so freaking good and I love this one this one's my favorite this is probably my third I think this is like my third bottle and I would 100% buy this again any day like whenever I run out I'll buy this again so yeah and one thing about lush shower gels I will mention I feel like I've been doing so much talking but their color the colors of these shower gels are so vibrant and so intense that I promise you it may sound weird but when you're washing your body with them it puts you in a good mood I don't know how to explain what it does but like something about this like the fragrances it makes you literally feel so much better so I highly recommend if you are somebody who is you know struggling mentally or you're just going through depression and anxiety and maybe you find relief in like skincare and self-care you know sessions I would highly recommend just you know ditching the drugstore body washes and trying something like this because I tell you when I get when I use that before bed I sleep so much better and it sounds so cheesy I know but it honestly is just such a nice product and I am in love and I will never stop buying them because they are amazing um let me think is there any more body washes I want to talk about I do have a couple more but like I guess I'll just throw this little dude in here this one is this pretty much done I have like nothing left <laughs> Which is a good thing this is rose jam and this is a rose absolute vanilla pod infusion with argan oil this one is one of my favorite scents to me i don't really smell roses very much i do but i don't this kind of just has a like something about this fragrance is so intoxicating it has this like undertone that like makes my mouth water i don't know what it is but literally it just smells so good i have the um mine is like so crumbled oh my god i can't even show you guys i have the rose jam bubble rune in this little bag i literally just crumble it up it looks like this like i crumble mine up and throw it in my bath water and it just smells so good it has that same kind of like mouth watering scent i don't know it doesn't make me want to eat it at all but it just makes my mouth water i don't know why but it smells so good i love that one and i'm almost out so i'm gonna have to buy a new one next time i'm on the website all right what else do we have we're gonna stay in the shower range bathtub range and we are gonna go with this bad boy this here is magic crystals and this is a shower scrub and this has epsom salt and mint infusion that smells very minty which is amazing the one thing i love about it which some people might not like but i do it is a very beautiful purple color it literally smells like so good i would recommend this especially in the winter time if you're someone who's very like sniffly and nasally this would clear your sinuses up it's honestly a very like light not overpowering scrub it's not very ab like a brace abrasive <laughs> it's not very abrasive it's just very nice and gentle on your skin and it leaves like a nice tingly feeling on your skin so i would say either use this in the winter time or even in the summertime where it's really hot outside and you kind of just want to like get the sweat and the stank off of you <laughs> use this in the shower and you will absolutely love it um also one thing that is new to me i got this back in may for my birthday and this is the fluff state the fluff shaving soap now this was my first time ever trying out a shaving soap and mine's a little crumbled up because my two-year-old 
got into it so she definitely had fun swirling around with this this is a very interesting smell this kind of to me smells like i don't know how to explain it smells like cinnamon to me i don't think there's cinnamon in it but yeah this kind of smells like cinnamon to me but it's a very like thick textured shaving soap and at first the first time i used this i didn't like it which was weird but i think i just wasn't using it the right way with this you really have to get a lot of water on your hands and really just lather it up and smooth it onto your skin and honestly it's a really nice product this is a little expensive for me i think this might have been like 17 dollars i want to say maybe i could be wrong but i like it i don't think i would buy this one again just because when it comes to shaving i'm really lazy i'll either use my body wash or i'll use like coconut oil which works really really well like i don't know it's not my favorite but i do like it now that i know how to use it but this is the conga shower jelly now if you guys don't know what a shower jelly is it's pretty much like let me show you oh please don't make a mess you see that it's like jello with body it's like body wash jello this one smells so good this one literally smells like a party it smells like fruit punch to me it's a very bright color very nice bright fresh scent this one smells very sweet like very candy very like daiquiri vacation-y smelling um i do like scents like this sometimes i definitely wouldn't use this on a daily basis but if i'm mixing it if i know i'm going to be wanting to smell a little bit more like fruity and fresh i would definitely use this because it smells so good and another thing the color is so pretty it's such a pretty color so yeah i like this one what do we have next we'll just go with another shower jelly that i have that i like this is whoosh shower jelly this one smells like lemon and lime mm, it literally smells like straight up like lemon it's just really pretty mine this one is how they kind of look after you mess around with it in the shower for a bunch they kind of gets more like that jello-y texture and you pretty much just pull a little bit out and rub it into your hands with the soap and water and wash up with it that way but this one's really nice this one has a very fresh citrusy scent it's very bright this is one i would probably use more in the morning time to kind of help wake me up and kind of make me feel like fresh and ready for the day so i really like this one as well so we're going to go ahead and get into the after lotion that i use on my body i use this mainly on my butt and my thighs this is called rump cheeky balm and this says keep your tush taunt with caffeine rich guarana and a rich floral why did i choose to read this one this one has so many weird words i don't know what am i trying to say you guys this is such it's got a butter in it this is literally so nice it's a very thick bomb i'm gonna have to really record these it's a very thick bomb it doesn't move when you try to flip it upside down it's a very thick consistency like this one just feels so silky and so small like so soft on your skin um i haven't really noticed any like results with it i don't use it every single time i go out the shower but it does feel really nice it does make your skin feel very firm and soft it's definitely more of that rich body butter texture that we all love and yeah i like this a lot it's not too greasy not too oily and yeah that's one of my favorites um, let's talk about feet. So feet wise, I have one foot lotion and I have a new mask I'm going to show you guys. This is softy foot lotion. This has a gentle lavender lotion to get your feet to get your feet back in tiptoe condition. I like this a lot. This is a very soft lavender scent. It's very nice. This one definitely makes my heels and feet a lot softer. I don't know if you guys are the same as me, but I do walk around barefoot a lot and sometimes my feet get a little bit dry, which is weird because I feel like my feet are drier now than they were back when I was working because <laughs> I'm currently at home with the baby every day. So I feel like my feet are really, really dry and kind of like, I don't know, they're just really dry. So that definitely has been helping my feet. Um 
last thing i'm gonna tell you guys before i get into the mini haul part oh i have two more things so one thing i do want to talk about i have that same american cream scent but i have it in a perfume in a solid perfume which this was my first time buying solid perfumes and i really like them um so pretty much all you do is you pretty much just have this little bomb you rub your finger into it and then you kind of just put it like on your pressure points behind your neck you know i usually put it like a little bit on my like right behind my ears i'll put it on my wrist i'll put it a little bit on my back so my hair kind of smells like it and it's just really nice um i will say that these are not very long lasting or maybe they are i don't know i only smell it for like the first hour that i'm wearing it and then i really don't smell it much after so yeah just this is something cute that you can kind of throw into your bag maybe if you want to kind of freshen up a little bit but you don't want it to be like an obvious like perfume smell or an obvious i just sprayed on body wash body <laughs> i just sprayed on like body spray this is definitely very cute and very like convenient and packaged okay and last but not least before we get into the mini haul one of my favorite things i forgot to mention actually I have two more things i'm sorry no one more thing one of the things i wanted to mention is this pumice foot scrubber for your feet this has been really really nice i love having this in the bathtub with me i like to rub my feet uh like the tops and bottoms of my feet this is very gentle not very abrasive it's just a very nice feeling it kind of feels like a clay mask on your feet and it really helps get rid of all that dry dead skin that happens to collect on your feet and toes throughout the day so i really like this all right and we're gonna go ahead and get into the haul because this video is getting out of control long <laughs> So first things first I got was the Volcano Foot Mask. This says cover your feet in kaolin clay and papaya mask to soften and deodorize. So I haven't used this one yet because pretty much you have to, they recommend you put it all over your feet and then you wrap them in plastic to keep the product from drying out and you leave for 10 minutes. I just haven't had time to give myself a full length pedicure yet. I will be doing one and I will film it just so you guys can see and I will use this product. But this like this <laughs> and it is very thick mask it kind of smells like it smells very natural it has like a very like clay medicinal kind of smell to it um i feel like i'm smelling garlic for some reason it has cinnamon lemon oil papaya potatoes maybe it's the potatoes I don't know it has just a very natural it's not heavily fragranced this does not smell very good it doesn't smell bad it just doesn't smell like really anything fragranced but yeah i'm excited to try this out on my feet i will show you guys in a video and let you know what i think um next thing i have is another solid perfume and this is the one a thousand kisses deep i literally only bought this because on the website it looked like it was like this really pretty like golden color which i'm all about gold everything so i bought this this to me is not my everyday scent but it does smell good this kind of gives me more of a fresh flower smell like very floral very like pretty it smells really good to me it's nothing like i have ever owned before i'm not a huge floral person but i can definitely see myself wearing this on certain occasions when i want to just smell like light and girly um the next thing that i got is a solid bath oil that goes in your bathtub this one's called dream time 2019 i got this because it has a z on it and if you guys don't know my daughter's name is zoe so i thought that was really cute but yeah i pretty much got this because i do like the bath oils from lush they are a little expensive for my taste this i think is like six or seven dollars so it's a little pricey for me but i do like them um when i have you what i usually do with my lush bath oils is i take them and i cut them in half so this one you know what this one's called i think this one's called like marshmallow something this one i have i kind of cut this one in half so you guys can see i kind of just cut off chunks and throw it in my bath water i know get out but like i said i like to kind of stretch my lush stuff out i don't want to use everything at one time i'm a little frivolous sometimes but i like to be you know conservative with my money with certain things and 
I don't have Lush stuff if I just use all of it up right away. So I gotta hold on to it. Um, the next bath oil I got, I used this one last night. And this one's called Polyamorous. It was in the shape of a heart. And now I kind of cut the cart in half of the pair of scissors. But this one's really nice too. This one has a very nice like florally kind of sweet smell to it it was very nice in the bath and then i water a beautiful shade of pink and i felt silky smooth when i got the bathtub um next thing i got got kind of crushed up in shipping this is the aurora borealis sugar body scrub so pretty much you see mine it's all like messed up it's all like all the sugars and everything are all crazy it just didn't work out with shipping you know but it's coming every it's coming all the way from canada so you kind of have to expect certain things this was really nice this has a very like nice scrub texture on it i can't wait to use that um I'm trying to hurry up and get off of here uh the next thing that i got i'm gonna show you guys are bath bombs i'm gonna work really quickly through this because i haven't used them yet this first one i think is called marshmallow dream i have to double check but this one's a really pretty pink purple mix this one just has a very sweet subtle it almost smells like the american cream um like line did i just put that yeah i did <laughs> what the hell okay so this one definitely smells i keep touching it on my face am i like on drugs what is happening this one just smells very good very soft very sweet um the next one i have i think this one is called intergalactic i think I'll leave a name for all these down below, but this one is really pretty. I got it because it has like little, little, little things in it. It's very pretty. It smells good. This one also has a very sweet, I don't know what this smells like to me. It has a very sweet, delicious smell to it. I like this one as well. The next one I have is called Rose Salt Cube. This one, I've kind of broke off a couple pieces and used this in the bathtub. This has a very fresh floral rose scent to it. Um, it's just really nice. The next time I use this, I'm just going to throw the whole bad boy in there because it's not a big bath bomb. But yeah, it smells very, very good. I like the way this one smells a lot. Um, next up, I have... God, I don't remember what these are called. Oh, I feel so bad. I have this guy right here. It's a very beautiful rainbow colorful one i cannot wait to use this this smells like this has like a very clean very like fresh smell to it maybe like gardenia i could be wrong but this one literally smells so good and it's so pretty i cannot wait to see how this looks in the bathtub also let me know down below if you guys want to see a lush bath routine because i do have a lush bath routine let me know if you'd be interested in showing and seeing that just because i feel like i would love to film something like that the last one I have, actually no, I have one more for this. This one is called Temple of the Sky. Of the Sun. Those two. Temple of the Sky, Temple of the Sun. I'm not sure. But this one is a really pretty, like, yellowy blue. It's got, like, this Chinese temple on it. It's gorgeous. This one smells really fresh and clean, too. It has, like, a lemony... I'm, like, getting this all over my face. It has like a lemony, fresh, clean scent to it. I really cannot wait to use this. That's why I'm going to be filming this video because I cannot wait to whip this bad boy out. And the last one that I have is still in the package. And this pretty pink and purple with a little floral rose on top. This smells so good. Smells so good and so clean. I think I'm actually gonna use this one tonight because it smells amazing. Yeah, it has like a very fresh florally scent to it, but very soft, not too much. Made a mess. All right, guys. I think that is. Actually, no. I have one more product. <laughs> i meant to talk about this i'm so sorry this video is so unorganized but this is silky underwear this is a dusting powder this smells like jasmine and it is amazing i have used this whenever i go out and it's really hot outside i will rub a little bit um, between my thighs underneath my arms this just helps prevent chafing but it smells literally so good also they recommend if you 
mine's open if you sprinkle some of this onto your sheets at night it just smells so relaxing and so good it smells like jasmine and cocoa butter it literally is amazing and i highly recommend you try this if you are someone who suffers from chafe this will do you some good but yeah you guys sorry to talk your head off I, this video is probably going to be so long but thank you so much for watching i hope you guys saw some things in here that you like if you've never been on lush website or in their store just go check it out they have amazing things everyone that works for them has always been so sweet and so nice to me whenever i'm in the store so yeah i just hope you guys fall in love just like i did and yeah thank you so much for watching and yes i hope you guys enjoyed this and you guys have a good rest of your day